Archaeological discoveries are like portals to the past, unlocking secrets and shining lights on civilizations long gone. The thrill of uncovering a lost treasure, a forgotten city, or an ancient artifact is an adventure in itself, filled with mystery, intrigue, and excitement. Each discovery means new knowledge about our past, things we've never imagined before being revealed with each artifact discovered. From the Dead Sea Scrolls to one of the most advanced technologies in the ancient world, here are 20 unsettling discoveries that might change history. Number 20. The Dead Sea Scrolls The Dead Sea Scrolls Cave is a complex of caves located on the northwest shore of the Dead Sea in the West Bank territory of the Palestinian Authority. The caves gained fame in the mid-20th century when several ancient Hebrew and Aramaic manuscripts were discovered inside. In total, 11 caves have been identified in the area, and the first scrolls were discovered in 1947 by a group of Bedouin shepherds. The scrolls were found in clay jars and were well preserved due to the dry and arid conditions of the area. The scrolls date back to the Second Temple period, from the 3rd century BCE to the 1st century CE. They include copies of the Hebrew Bible as well as other Jewish texts and writings that shed light on the beliefs and practices of the Jewish people during that time. In 2017, archaeologists announced the discovery of a 12th cave in the area. Although no scrolls were found inside the cave, the cavern contained many pottery fragments and a leather strap, indicating that it may have been used for the storage of scrolls at some point. The discovery of the Dead Sea Scrolls has been hailed as one of the most significant archaeological finds of the 20th century, providing valuable insights into the religious and cultural practices of ancient Jewish communities. The Dead Sea Scrolls not only contain copies of the Hebrew Bible, but they also reveal the beliefs, practices, and culture of Jewish people in the past. Without the Dead Sea Scrolls, we wouldn't know as much about the people who lived around the Dead Sea in the past. In the past, however, several scroll fragments were sold and posted in the classified section. Who knows? Those lost fragments could have contained passages that changed the world forever. Before we go on, like this video, smash the subscribe button, and click the notification bell right now. Number 19. The Sunken City of Heraklion Beneath the waters of the Mediterranean is the sunken city of Heraklion, one of the most historical wrecks hidden from the rest of the world. For countless centuries, the city of Thonis Heraklion lay concealed beneath the ocean, known only to a select few who saw its name in inscriptions and historical texts. Heraklion was once a bustling port city that eventually sank to the bottom of the ocean, lost forever, until a team of underwater archaeologists in 2000 discovered it. The sunken city of Heraklion lies deep beneath the waves, its ruins an enigmatic reminder of a lost civilization that once thrived along the Nile Delta. This ancient city is shrouded in mystery, and many of its secrets have disappeared forever, eaten by the ocean waves. However, if you descend into the ruins, you'd still get a glimpse of the city's past, its bustling roads, grand palaces, and grandiose statues. The sunken city of Heraklion is of significant importance as it offers a unique insight into the ancient world and its civilization. It was once a prosperous port city and served as the gateway to Egypt for traders from Greece and other Mediterranean countries. The city was a center of trade, religion, and culture, and its ruins provided valuable information about ancient Egyptian and Greek architecture, art, religion, and daily life. Number 18. The Largest Mayan Structure the Maya were a people of great sophistication, with an intricate system of hieroglyphic writing, advanced knowledge of astronomy and mathematics, and a complex society that included priests, nobles, and artisans. Their vibrant culture was infused with colorful rituals, elaborate ceremonies, and fascinating myths. Recently, scientists stumbled upon a discovery that rewrote what they knew about this incredible civilization. Scientists have made a groundbreaking discovery using aerial remote sensing technology. They've uncovered a massive rectangular platform in Tabasco, Mexico that was built between 1000 and 800 BC by the ancient Maya civilization. This incredible structure, known as Aguada Phoenix, is the largest and oldest of its kind, measuring an impressive 400 meters wide and 1,400 meters long, standing at 10 to 15 meters high. The platform served as a gathering place for many people from the surrounding areas for special events, which were likely linked to calendrical cycles. During these occasions, they would have marched along the causeways and within the rectangular plaza, leaving behind the symbolic objects such as jade axes. 
The discovery challenges the long-held belief that the Maya society evolved from small villages into larger urban centers. Although the site lacks a city center, it's estimated that 5,000 people could have built it in approximately six years. This significant finding sheds new light on the architectural and social development of the Mayan civilization, and it will undoubtedly provide invaluable insight into the history of the region. Number 17. The Oldest Human Fossil In 1967, archaeologists discovered the fossilized skull of Omo I, now known as the oldest human fossil ever found. The discovery of Omo I has provided invaluable insight into the evolution of our species, Homo sapiens. When the fossil was first discovered, it was not immediately clear how old it was. But subsequent studies using radiometric dating techniques revealed that the skull was around 195,000 years old. This makes Omo I one of the earliest examples of anatomically modern humans. The skull is remarkably well preserved, with a high forehead, large brain case, and prominent brow ridges. It's believed that Omo I was a member of a population that was ancestral to all modern humans. For over 50 years, the fossil has been recognized as one of the most ancient Homo sapiens skulls in existence worldwide. Initially believed to be the oldest, its status changed in 2017 when 300,000-year-old skull, jaw, and tooth fragments were discovered in Jebel Irhud, Morocco. In 2005, a study using radioactive dating found that the age of the fossil skull was 195,000 years old. But recent analysis brought back Omo One's title of being the oldest fossil ever discovered in the world, suggesting that Omo One is actually tens of thousands of years older. There was some controversy around the initial dating of Omo One, as the ash layer used for dating was found further away from the fossil than where it was discovered. However, scientists have now determined the age of the eruption that deposited the ash by analyzing rocks closer to their volcanic sources which contain larger crystals suitable for radiometric dating. The skull shape of Omo I provides insight into the appearance of humans living in eastern Africa approximately 230,000 years ago, indicating that they had already evolved to resemble modern humans. The evolution of humankind may be rewritten in the future again. Number 16. An Egyptian Priestess A recent discovery in Egypt revealed a fascinating part of ancient Egypt a wonderfully adorned tomb of a priestess who lived over 4,000 years ago. Upon entering the tomb, visitors are greeted by the spectacular artwork that adorns the walls. The murals depict scenes from the priestess' life. The walls are also decorated with well-preserved paintings, including depictions of the priestess hunting and fishing, people making leather goods and melting metal, and dancing. A notable addition to the artwork is the presence of monkeys, which were kept as pets at the time. A monkey can be seen picking fruit and carrying a basket, while another is depicted dancing in front of an orchestra. This is only the second painting discovered so far to feature a monkey dancing. Archaeologists believe the priestess was named Hetpet, who served the goddess of fertility, music, and dance, Hathor. While female priests were not prevalent in ancient Egypt, Hathor's priesthood featured several priestesses. Hetpet's name and title are inscribed on a purification basin inside the tomb providing further evidence of her identity. Hetpet lived during Egypt's fifth dynasty, a period called the Old Kingdom. This was the era of the Great Pyramid building in Egypt when pharaohs ruled and many temples and palaces were built. Number 15. Ancient Viking Ship The Usberg ship is a well-preserved Viking ship discovered in a burial mound in Norway in 1903. The discovery of the Usberg ship was an exciting moment in the history of archaeology as it provided valuable insight into the Viking Age and their culture. Inside the ship, archaeologists found a wealth of artifacts, including textiles, woodworking tools, and household items. There were also the remains of two women, who were believed to be of high social status buried in the ship. They were thought to be buried together in the ship as part of a Viking funeral ceremony. The oldest of the two women was around 80 years old when she perished. Subsequent analysis indicated that she had experienced severe arthritis and had Morgani syndrome, a condition that could have resulted in a more masculine physical appearance, including facial hair growth. The other person seemed younger, estimated to be between 50 and 55 years old. It's unclear which of the two was of greater significance during their lifetime, or whether one was deliberately sacrificed to accompany the other in death. Although the younger woman initially appeared to have suffered a violent end, 
Closer examination revealed that her broken collarbone had been healing for several weeks prior to her death. The luxurious nature of the burial ceremony and the inclusion of valuable grave goods strongly suggest that this was a burial of exceptionally high status. Number 14. The Lost Golden City of Luxor In April 2021, archaeologists announced the stunning discovery of the Lost Golden City of Luxor, Egypt, a city believed to be over 3,000 years old. A team of experts from the Egyptian Ministry of Tourism and Antiquities discovered the ruins. The site was first spotted in September 2020, when archaeologists began excavating an area near the Valley of the Kings, a royal burial ground in Luxor. They were searching for the mortuary temple of King Tutankhamun, but instead stumbled upon the remains of a massive city hidden beneath the sand for millennia. The city, which dates back to the reign of Amenhotep III, was a bustling metropolis with palaces, temples, and residential quarters. Archaeologists believe it was built to serve as a home for the pharaoh's family and entourage. The city remained in use for several generations, but was eventually abandoned and buried beneath the sand. The discovery of the lost golden city is considered one of Egypt's most significant archaeological finds in recent years. The city has been remarkably well preserved, with many buildings and artifacts intact. Archaeologists have found pottery, jewelry, and other objects used in daily life, as well as tools and equipment used in the city's construction. One of the most remarkable finds at the site was a giant statue of Amenhotep III, which is believed to be the first of its kind ever discovered in Egypt. The figure is made of alabaster and is nearly 12 feet tall. Other notable discoveries include a collection of clay seals believed to have been used to mark goods and documents. The discovery of the lost golden city of Luxor is a reminder of the incredible wealth and power of ancient Egypt and the enduring fascination that this civilization holds for people around the world. As archaeologists continue to explore the site, they will unlikely uncover even more secrets about this long-lost city and the incredible civilization of ancient Egypt. Number 13. The Oldest DNA Humans have had a long fascination with the creatures who roamed our planet long before our modern ancestors did. However, Earth reveals its secrets gradually, and recently scientists were lucky enough to discover a gateway to our past, the oldest known DNA. Using the oldest known DNA, scientists were able to uncover a glimpse into the environment of northern Greenland two million years ago, which was vastly different from its current barren Arctic state. The DNA extracted revealed a diverse ecosystem consisting of trees, vegetation, and animals, including the now-extinct mastodon, and surprisingly reindeer, which were previously thought to have been absent from Greenland. Traditional animal fossils are difficult to come by, so researchers instead extracted environmental DNA, also known as eDNA from soil samples to study the genetic materials shed by organisms through hair, waste, spit, or decomposing carcasses. Despite the challenge of studying ancient DNA, advancements in technology allowed researchers to obtain genetic information from fragmented and degraded DNA. This new information has the potential to shed light on past ecosystems that were not fully recorded in the fossil record. Previously, the oldest DNA was a 700,000-year-old strand discovered in the permafrost. In the future, archaeologists might discover DNA that is older and more significant than the one in the frozen terrain of Greenland. Number 12. The Oldest Beer in the World Let's face it, most adults like drinking, and that's fine as long as you do it in moderation. A recent discovery revealed people in the past two centuries weren't the only ones who enjoyed drinking beer. In fact, the oldest beer discovered dates back to ancient times, providing a fascinating glimpse into the early origins of one of the world's most beloved beverages. So, who wants a cold one? particularly a drink that has been chilling at the bottom of the ocean for the last two centuries. In 2020, a group of Australian researchers made an incredible discovery off the coast of Tasmania, a 220-year-old stash of beer preserved in near-perfect condition inside the wreckage of a ship. The ship, which is believed to have been a trading vessel known as the Sydney Cove, had sunk off the coast of Tasmania in the early 19th century while traveling from India to a port known as Port Jackson. The beer was discovered in the ship's hold, where it had been stored in barrels. Despite being submerged in seawater for over two centuries, the beer was remarkably well preserved. The researchers even tasted a sample of the beer, describing it as having a smoky, almost peaty flavor. 
The discovery of this ancient beer offers a fascinating glimpse into the history of brewing. It underscores the fact that beer has been an integral part of human culture for centuries. It also highlights the incredible resilience of beer, which was able to withstand the harsh conditions of the ocean for over 200 years and emerge virtually unscathed. As we continue to explore the rich history and cultural significance of beer, discoveries like this offer a window into the past, helping us to better understand the evolution of one of humanity's oldest and most beloved beverages. Would you be interested in trying out this beer? For fun, researchers tried brewing a drink using the yeast they discovered in the beer, one that hasn't been on our planet for centuries. So being able to try this drink would be an incredibly rare situation. Number 11. Homo naledi fossils. Homo naledi is a hominin species discovered in 2013 in the Rising Star cave system in South Africa. It's one of the most significant archaeological discoveries of recent times and has provided us with valuable insight into human evolution. The discovery of Homo naledi was made by a team of researchers led by paleoanthropologist Lee Berger. The team discovered a collection of over 1,000 fossilized bones, including several complete skulls and skeletons in a chamber deep within the cave system. The fossils were dated to be around 300,000 years old. Homo naledi was a small-statured hominin with a brain size similar to Australopithecus, an earlier hominin species. However, it had features similar to modern humans, such as its long legs, relatively short arms, and curved fingers. Its feet were also remarkably similar to modern humans, suggesting that it may have been an early ancestor of our own species. The discovery of Homo naledi has challenged our understanding of human evolution and raised many questions about the origins of our species. For example, it's unclear how Homo naledi relates to other hominin species, such as Homo erectus or Homo habilis. It's also unclear how this species survived and evolved alongside other hominin species, such as the Neanderthals who lived in other parts of the world around the same time. Despite these uncertainties, the discovery of Homo naledi has provided important new information about human evolution. It has helped to fill in gaps in our understanding of the fossil record and has challenged many of our assumptions about the evolution of our species. Number 10. The Ancient City of Tania In 2018, archaeologists made a remarkable discovery in the Peloponnese region of Greece, the ancient city of Tania, which had been lost for over 2,000 years. Tania was a prosperous city in ancient Greece, known for its wealth and cultural significance. It was home to a diverse population of Greeks, Romans, and other people from across the Mediterranean. The discovery of Tania has been hailed as a significant breakthrough in archaeology, as it provides new insights into the complex and interconnected world of ancient Greece. The city was home to several impressive buildings and monuments, including a large theater, a gymnasium, and a temple dedicated to the goddess Athena. Number 9. The Tomb of a Mayan Queen Archaeologists excavating deep in the lush jungles of Guatemala stumbled upon an incredibly rare discovery, the tomb of a woman, specifically a Mayan queen who ruled the land more than 1,200 years ago. The queen's remains were covered with relics and artifacts, and archaeologists claimed that the way she was prepared in her last moments made her look both male and female, a practice that was perhaps a norm in the civilization. When she died, she was interred in a tomb that measured 11 feet long, 4 feet wide, and about 6 feet high. Her people meticulously arranged 1,600 artifacts around her tomb, including plated helmets and other jewelry. This discovery will shed light on the incredibly fascinating Mayan civilization. Number 8. The London Hammer The London Hammer also known as the London Artifact, is one of the most intriguing and controversial artifacts ever discovered in the past century. Some say this artifact is proof that time travel is possible, while some see it merely as an elaborate hoax. Even the story of how this artifact was discovered remains to be a mystery. There are different versions as to how the hammer was found. However, the most popular story claims the hammer was discovered in the mid-1980s by a couple named Max and Emma Hahn while on a walk near London, Texas. The artifact, which is often referred to as the out-of-place artifact, is a hammer that appears to be made of iron and wood and is said to be over 400 million years old. The discovery of the London Hammer caused a stir in the archaeological community because it contradicted widely accepted theories about the history of human civilization. According to conventional wisdom, humans did not exist 400 million years ago. 
and the use of iron tools did not begin until much later in history. Several scientists tested the hammer, and the results of their tests were inconclusive. Some experts claimed that the hammer was a modern forgery, while others argued that it was indeed an ancient artifact that had somehow been preserved in the rock formations in which it was found. The controversy surrounding the London Hammer highlights the difficulties that archaeologists and scientists face when trying to interpret unusual and anomalous artifacts. While the hammer may appear to be a simple tool, its discovery raises profound questions about the history of human civilization and the nature of the universe itself. Did someone put in the effort to forge an ancient artifact just for the fun of it? The truth might forever change the history of humankind. Number 7. The Lost City of the Monkey God The Lost City of the Monkey God, also known as the Ciudad Blanca or the White City, is an ancient civilization rumored to have existed deep in the jungles of Honduras. For centuries, stories and legends about the city had circulated among the indigenous people of the region, but it was only recently that archaeologists were able to confirm its existence. In 2012, a team of researchers used advanced technology to survey the dense jungle region of Mesquitia, northeastern Honduras. Using airborne laser technology, archaeologists created a detailed map of the area that revealed the presence of a large, previously unknown city. Over the next several years, the team made several expeditions to the region to explore the city and learn more about its history. They discovered several artifacts, including ceremonial plazas, sculptures, and buildings, many of which appeared untouched since the city was abandoned centuries ago. The lost city of the monkey god has been hailed as one of the most important archaeological discoveries of the modern era. It has provided valuable insight into the history and culture of the indigenous people who once lived in the region. It has also raised questions about the nature of the city itself, including why it was abandoned and how it could remain hidden for so long. Number 6. The Nampa Figurine The Nampa Figurine is an ancient artifact discovered in the 1880s near Nampa, Idaho. The figurine is a small clay sculpture of a human figure estimated to be between 2,000 and 2,800 years old. What makes the Nampa Figurine unique is that it was discovered in a layer of rock that's believed to be between 2 and 12 million years old, leading to significant controversy and debate within the scientific community. The discovery of the Nampa figurine has been the subject of much controversy, with some experts arguing that it's a modern forgery. In contrast, others claim that it's indeed an ancient artifact that has somehow managed to become embedded in a much older layer of rock. The artifact's discovery in a layer of rock millions of years old has led some to speculate that it may be evidence of advanced ancient civilizations that existed on Earth long before modern humans. Number 5. The Rosetta Stone the Rosetta Stone is a famous artifact that was discovered in 1799 by a French soldier during Napoleon's campaign in Egypt. It is a large inscribed stone that became the key to unlocking the secrets of ancient Egyptian hieroglyphics. The stone is made of black basalt and stands over three feet tall. It's inscribed with three versions of the exact text, ancient Greek, Demotic script, and Egyptian hieroglyphics. The Greek text was easily understood but the other two scripts were a mystery, as the hieroglyphics had not been used for over a thousand years. However, French scholars quickly recognized the significance of the stone and made copies of the inscriptions. These copies were eventually used by a British scholar, Thomas Young, who made significant progress in deciphering the hieroglyphics. However, another British scholar, Jean-Francois Champollion, finally cracked the code in 1822, using the Rosetta Stone as a key to understanding the meaning of hieroglyphics. The discovery of the Rosetta Stone was a significant breakthrough in studying ancient Egyptian civilization. It allowed scholars to finally understand the hieroglyphic script, which had been a mystery for centuries. It also provided a wealth of information about the Egyptian pharaohs, their reigns, and the religious and cultural practices. Understanding Egyptian hieroglyphics was a crucial breakthrough for studying the ancient Egyptian civilization. It allowed archaeologists and Egyptologists to unravel the tomes and texts left behind by the ancient civilization. Number 4. Decoding of Linear A Linear A is a script that was used by the ancient Minoan civilization of Crete, which flourished during the Bronze Age. It's a script that has never been deciphered, leaving many questions about Minoan culture and their language unanswered. The script was discovered by archaeologist Sir Arthur Evans in the early 20th century along with a related script, Linear B. 
Linear B was eventually deciphered in the 1950s, revealing that it was used to write the early form of the Greek language. However, despite many attempts, Linear A is yet to be deciphered. The symbols of Linear A are inscribed on various artifacts, including clay tablets, seals, and other objects. They consist of over 100 different symbols, many of which are complex and highly stylized. Some symbols are similar to those found in Linear B, suggesting a connection between the two scripts. But most symbols are unique to Linear A. Because the script has never been deciphered, we know very little about the language and culture of the Minoans. The Minoan civilization was thought to be highly advanced, with a sophisticated economy, social structure, and artistic tradition. They're known for their exquisite pottery, intricate frescoes, sophisticated jewelry, and complex architectural achievements, such as the famous palace at Knossos. Despite the mysteries that still surround Linear A, it remains a fascinating and vital piece of ancient history. The fact that we have not yet deciphered this script only adds to the allure and intrigue of the Minoan civilization and the rich cultural legacy that has been left behind. As archaeologists and linguists continue to study Linear A, we may one day unravel its secrets and gain a deeper understanding of the fascinating world of the Minoans. Number 3. Gobekli Tepe In an ancient landscape surrounded by towering stone pillars with intricate carvings of animals and symbols, Gobekli Tepe is one of the most enigmatic and intriguing archaeological sites in the world that gave us new information about the ancient world and the societal dynamics that shaped our history. Gobekli Tepe is an ancient archaeological site located in southeastern Turkey, believed to be one of the oldest known human-made structures in the world. It was discovered in the 1990s and has been the subject of extensive research and excavation ever since. What makes Gobekli Tepe so unique is the sheer scale and sophistication of its architecture, which dates back more than 11,000 years. The site consists of several circular stone structures, each containing massive pillars adorned with intricate carvings of animals and other symbols. The construction of Gobekli Tepe is particularly remarkable because it predates the invention of agriculture and the emergence of settled societies, challenging traditional notions of human development and societal evolution. It is thought to have been constructed by hunter-gatherer societies, previously believed to have been incapable of such monumental construction projects. The purpose of Gobekli Tepe remains a subject of debate among archaeologists and historians, with some suggesting that it may have had religious or ceremonial significance, while others speculate that it may have been used for social and communal gatherings. Number 2. The Void Inside the the pyramids of Egypt are not just impressive feats of engineering and architecture, but also hold a profound cultural and spiritual significance for the people in Egypt. For the ancient Egyptians, the pyramids were not just tombs for the pharaohs, but were believed to be gateways to the afterlife, where the pharaoh's soul would journey to the realm of the gods. The elaborate rituals and ceremonies that accompany the construction and opening of the pyramids were a reflection of the importance that the Egyptians placed on the afterlife and the eternal nature of the soul. The Pyramid of Khufu, also known as the Great Pyramid, is one of the most iconic and enigmatic structures of the ancient world. Despite being one of the oldest and largest man-made structures on Earth, it still holds many mysteries, including the presence of a large void located inside its interior. In 2017, a team of scientists used advanced technology to detect the presence of the void. Estimated to be around 30 meters long, and located above the Grand Gallery, one of the pyramid's main passageways. The purpose and function of the void are still unknown, and scientists are still working to unravel the mysteries of this ambiguous space. Some speculate that it may have had a religious or ritualistic purpose, while others believe that it may have been used for storing or displaying important artifacts. The discovery of the void has sparked renewed interest in the study of the Great Pyramid and the ancient civilization that built it. It underscores the incredible engineering and architectural achievements of the ancient Egyptians and the deep-rooted mystery and fascination that the pyramids continue to hold for people around the world. And now it's time for today's topic. This former U.S. soldier has just revealed the truth about what he and his team saw while on duty. The theories about aliens visiting our planet have long been a topic of fascination and speculation among both believers and skeptics alike. Some have claimed that extraterrestrial beings have made contact with people on Earth, while others believe that such encounters are nothing more than figments of overactive imaginations. However, some have delved deeper into the possibility that aliens have visited our planet, 
particularly the military bases in the United States, and have come up with some genuinely creative theories. One such theory posits that the aliens were drawn to the soldiers because of their advanced weaponry and technology. It sounds quite far-fetched, but a soldier claimed to have seen a strange disc while completing his duty near a military base. Are rumors about extraterrestrial beings not completely baseless after all? What do you think? As always, comment down below with the hashtag today's topic and let us know your opinion about what we just showed on screen. With that said, let's keep things moving. Number 1. The First Computer The Antikythera Mechanism is a marvel of ancient engineering, a complex and sophisticated mechanism considered one of the oldest known examples of a geared apparatus. Discovered in 1901 in the Antikythera shipwreck off the coast of Greece, the appliance was initially thought to be an astronomical instrument. It consists of at least 30 bronze gears and displays the position of the sun, moon, and planets, as well as the timing of eclipses and the Olympic Games. The level of sophistication and precision in the mechanism is astounding, especially considering that it was constructed over 2,000 years ago. Its design and construction are a testament to the ingenuity and skill of ancient engineers and astronomers. Although the exact purpose and function of the Antikythera mechanism are still a subject of debate among scholars, it's clear that it represents a significant advance in the development of scientific instruments and the understanding of the cosmos. The discovery and study of the Antikythera mechanism have shed light on the technological and scientific achievements of ancient civilizations and have deepened our understanding of the history of science and engineering. Today, the Antikythera mechanism remains one of the most intriguing and captivating artifacts of the ancient world, a testament to the ingenuity and creativity of our ancestors, and a source of inspiration for future generations of scientists and engineers. This artifact was so far ahead of its time that modern historians called it the very first computer invented by mankind. We've discovered a lot about our past, but perhaps we're not even close to unraveling everything about the past civilizations. What do you think is the most significant discovery in the history of mankind? Let me know about what you think in the comments down below. Also, check out our other cool stuff showing up on the screen right now, and I'll see you in the next video. Take care, everybody.